حسبي جل ما في قلبي إلا الله حق 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 الله الله رب 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 سبحان الله Sayyiduna Rasulullah sallallahu ta'ala alayhi wa sallam in a narration has mentioned for five things to be the pillars of Islam. Of these five pillars, we find that one of them is extremely unique because this is a pillar which not only has to do with our relationship with our Creator subhanahu wa ta'ala, but this has to do with our relationship with the community as well. And that is the obligation of zakat. The obligation of zakat is the mandatory charity that the individuals who are doing well financially, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has placed this obligation upon them to give only 2.5% of their wealth to their needy Muslim brothers. We see in the religion of Islam a great balance that whereas we are permitted to gather wealth, we are permitted to have a nice house, to have a nice car, but all of that wealth, it usually brings with itself some negative energy. It brings with itself some negative aspects as well. And one of them is this negativity of greed. Wherein one only sees himself, he does not see the people around him, he does not see the people struggling. But Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, what a beautiful way He has designed to eradicate this negative aspect of earning wealth. Sayyiduna Rasulullah sallallahu ta'ala alayhi wa sallam, where in one narration, he states Al-Kasibu Habibullah That the one who earns wealth is the beloved of Allah After this we are also seeing the concept of zakat To balance out those negative aspects that wealth bring with it Sayyiduna Hujjatul Islam Al-Imam Ghazali alayhi rahma He states that this giving of zakat The offering of zakat It removes greed from a person It purifies a person And as much as one spends in the way of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, that is how much this characteristic, this illness of greed leaves our hearts. This is the balance that Islam teaches. But it is a shame that whereas Islam is giving us such a beautiful way to support love within the community and growth within the community, helping out the people that are around us, many individuals do not know the rulings of zakat. Many individuals do not know how to go about fulfilling this obligation of zakat. Zakat is only paying 2.5% of your wealth to a needy individual. But people still see this as a burden. If we put this into perspective and we see that if a person has a thousand dollars and he has to pay zakat on this wealth, if he is feeling for it to be a burden, then he has to think of the fact that this is only $25 that he has to give to someone. And this giving of wealth is not only going to help that individual, it is going to put that individual's love in the heart of that person. This wealth is going to earn him the pleasure of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. This is the wealth that is going to purify the rest of his wealth so that his heart opens up and he is able to spend more freely in the way of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala.